Hello and welcome to Let's Play Star Wars The Force Unleashed with me, Mr. Muck Luckable. In the last episode, well, we fought Proxy in a big boss battle and I got very confused, as I have done many times in this Let's Play now. Um, I thought he betrayed us or something, but it turns out I just got it completely wrong again. Um, he's supposed to kill us, that's his main aim, that's his main programmed thing. I mean, I did. I remember him trying to kill us before, right near the beginning. Oh man! But I thought that was just like a a one-off thing. But no, that's his whole task. And and he seemed like such a nice robot as well. But no, he just go ahead and kill us. So he's nice, and he's also very evil and wants to kill us. Very odd mixture there. It is like I was reading about that robot. They said they wanted him to be a mixture of C-3PO, which he definitely is. That's why I thought he was so kind and lovable because he was a bit like C-3PO, but they also want to make him like um, the robot from Knights of the Old Republic. And I can't really remember his name, it's like H1K1 or something. Um, go away. So they wanted to make a mixture of those two for this, for, uh, for Proxy, and they have, because they've made him nice and they've made him deadly evil as well. Now, whoa. Okay, so now we're outside where that massive fireball was. What are the objectives here? Overload the accelerator towers to destroy the shipyard. Okay. I may have got a bit distracted by the boss battle, to be fair. But that's okay. You're not even paying any attention to me. So I wanted to bring up, um, in today's episode, just something very small about the Star Wars franchise that I was thinking about just earlier today, actually. Whatever happened to um, the Star Wars television series that was supposed to happen? So I remember reading about that many, many years ago. Um, well, a few years ago anyway. Internet, internet years always seem um, longer than they actually are. But <laughs> oh, come here! Right, I have to do something here. Don't run away just yet. I have to probably zap this, don't I? Yeah. One of four railgun tracks overloaded. So I was thinking about that because I remember reading a couple of things about it, how it's going to be like hour-long shows focusing on uh, when this time period actually, this kind of time period between the prequels and the originals. And it's going to focus on ooh, bounty hunters and and things like that. And it's going to be more gritty and, and realistic, like everything is. Everything has to be gritty and realistic and all nasty. That's just the the... The social fad we're in. Nothing has to be. Nothing's too happy, really. <laughs> um, but that just seemed to have disappeared off the face of the earth. I know it was greenlit, or it was supposed to be, but then it was money, and then they have all the scripts ready, but they weren't doing anything with them. It just seems really odd, and I wonder how that's going to be affected by the Disney takeover. Whether they're going to, whether they're going to do it, whether they're going to actually carry on. Because I read that they have like 50 scripts. 50. Ready to use, ready to shoot. Isn't that, isn't that weird? It's a bit like how I was saying last episode with how they... Well, not last episode, but a few episodes ago. How they practically finished Battlefront 3 and then they had to stop. Like they put all this effort in and then there's no... There's no result of it. Alright, let me just finish these guys off. That sniper. Oh, no. <gasps> oh, we just crashed! No, that can't be the first crash of the Let's Play. Damn it! Oh, well that's disappointing. Just as that big meteorite wouldn't pop out as well. Damn! Alright, I'll be back in a second. Okay, we're back. I, I hope so anyway. There's two or four railgun tracks overloaded. That's roughly where we were before we crashed. That's no good. At least we need the end of the Let's Play though, so... Um, if it becomes a problem then we're not too bad I think it was just I don't know I don't know why that happened uh, oh, I thought it was my Xbox then I was like no 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 red rings or anything like that please because I have had it for well it must be like what 2008 so five years now that's a while still going strong though hopefully well after that crash so where, where, where was I that's it um the Star Wars TV show. Yeah. I do wonder if Disney are going to 
take that on. I think they should. I think Disney have the money. They pour money into it. Um, and obviously has to have good writing. So I don't know if the um, the scripts that I mentioned about were done by George Lucas. I'm guessing they probably weren't. I, I'd like to think George Lucas knows he's not a good writer and, and would give it to someone else. But I'm just not sure, actually. Okay, so how many have we done? Have we done this one? Yeah, it's that one right over... Ooh! Right over there. But I, I do remember reading quite a bit about that TV show. I'd watch it. I'd definitely watch it. Um, probably have to watch it illegally, though, because it'll be on American TV or it'll probably be on some Sky Channel that we don't have over here in Britain. England. Okay, let's go this way. I think it's this one over here. That one looks like it hasn't been zapped yet because there are guys over there. I mean, this looks like a pretty... What is that? Oh, it's scrap, isn't it? It's like the... Shipyard. Maybe that's like leftovers. They just throw it into space like in Futurama. It's going to come back down and crush us all. Come here. These guys aren't particularly difficult now. So let's do that. <gasps> Bring down the Imperial Star Destroyer. This is it. Okay, I actually wanted to pay attention there because this thing seems like quite a big deal. So I've got to destroy these TIE fighters, I guess? Can I pick them up? Oh no! Oh man, this is a bit overwhelming. I knew this would be, like, crazy. No! Come here! Zap you! Right, so I'm stuck in this... X axis, yes. I can't move forward or backwards. Oh, I can, okay. But I can't really. Come here, let me pick that thing up. Oh, right, it's just exploded. Alright, so how how are we meant to do this? Can we go over this way? Do we need to go over that way? I have a feeling we need to pick up these blue things. They keep whizzing past right in my face. Maybe I can saber throw. Let's try that. Ready? Well, that did nothing. Oh. Okay, I don't think I actually wanted to throw it there. And I'm almost dead. So this is this has been... <laughs> this has been successful. Oh, okay. So we don't just grab hold of it and pull it. Obviously not. I think there's something else we need to do first. Um, look at that. If that took damage away straight away, that I'd be so annoyed. Okay, right. Let's hide behind this, because we don't really seem to get shot here. Oh, did I, did I just zap one? Oh no, that was, that was the wrong thing. Let's just take this slowly. Go. Nope, jump up. Zap. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure how to aim on something. Runner for... Gun tracks overloaded. Oh, do we still need to... Overload the gun tracks. I thought we'd done that. I don't think that's just been updated. Because our, our objective has changed. It's now bring down the Star Destroyer. I'm now stuck here for some reason. Some weird perspective going on there. What the hell? Oh, this game is not being kind to me today. First a crash. And now that... What What was that? Ugh. Um... This may require quite a few cuts, I'm guessing. Can I jump on these? No. I can't quite pick them up. I can't really see where the blue target's going to be. Let's try and grab one of those... Here we are, these blue things, and throw it at him. No. Oh no, I dropped it. <laughs> I dropped the ball. Come on now. Bring me another one. I just got to keep moving, because there's, there's green... Oh, yes, there we go. That got one. There's... 
lasers being fired everywhere. And I'm getting hit by them all. Damn. He exploded that one before I could throw it. I'm not quite sure why. Maybe it's like waves of things we need to get rid of. Oh yeah, that was good. Just let me pull down the Star Destroyer, please. Here we go. No, nope, he exploded that. Damn you. I, this is this is looking familiar though. I do this bit looks familiar. So we're definitely doing it. Uh, come on, you. All right, that just chucked it at that. Not really what I wanted. Can I lightning them? Can I do this? No, damn it. No, definitely not. Aiming is really difficult in this. You have to rely on the on the computer, the game, to aim for you. Oh, damn it. Keep aiming over there. Okay. Yeah, this is going to be slow. I have to keep waiting for those things. Pick, quick, pick it up. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Good. Would be nice if there was something on screen telling me that this was the right thing to do, though. Quickly pick that up. Come here. No, he keeps throwing it the wrong way. Throw it forward, you fool. Right, go, 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 go. Yes. Yes, yeah, that kind of curve towards him. Yeah. There does seem to be less of them, to be honest. It does seem to be a lot less. In fact, there just seems to be this one. You die. Oh, here we go. <gasps> what do I have to do? Huh? Following the instructions. Oh god. I have to do I have to do it really quickly, do I? Or just follow it. <laughs> what am I doing? I reckon I have to do it faster than it's actually showing me. Up. Oh, no, I have to do it at the same time. Okay, fair enough. Wow, this is a bit boring. <laughs> oh, up. Down. We're just making it rock gently. We have to get into the right pattern, the right motion. Oh no, the TIE fight's coming back. Oh, I died! Oh, hell no! Oh man! I was. Oh. I was doing it then. Oh. What? I'll do it all over again now, don't I? Okay, well, uh, this is where the cuts start, I guess. I'll see you in a bit. Right, we're done. We're back. I've got the pattern sorted. Um, go. Let's try and do this right this time. Up, down. It's weird though, it doesn't seem to register very well. Come on. Do it. Why is it not doing it? Oh, it is doing it, but is it doing it right? I don't know. Up, down, up. I oh, know it is turning, look, it is turning very, very slowly. Oh, here comes TIE Fighters though. We better let go. <laughs> yep, let's let go. Right, I'll show you the pattern I've got for this. Because they do actually follow a pattern. So. This one's going to turn at the end. Ready? There you go. They kind of do a figure of eight around. Oh no! Around these two kind of stands. Oh, it's happened again. I've got stuck here. Why does this keep happening? I can't look. I, there's like an invisible wall that's pushing me. Oh, that's just not fair. That's just not fair. Oh, I don't know why it keeps doing that. Pushing me behind an invisible wall. I've got to do it all over again. Oh. Okay, I've been doing it wrong this whole damn time. Oh, I can't believe that. It. I wasn't even turning it. It seems you have to like hold it there. Although the thing doesn't look like it's doing that. Oh man, but look, this is what it needs to do. You need to turn it like this. 
I mean, I can get rid of the TIE Fighters really easy now. It was just this thing that was really bugging me. I didn't know how to do it. But it turns out you just have to get the controls right. And they should make it a bit simpler because I did not understand that. And I was... Well, I, I am stupid, but... <laughs> I, I spent like half an hour doing that and I spent half an hour doing it wrong. I was like, no! No, I haven't been doing it wrong. And it does turn. You can see it turn when you don't... I, uh, when you're fighting the TIE Fighters, which is a bit mean. You have to do these very quickly. Like that. Yeah. Oh, unless you miss it. I think they're all going to come this side now. But I think we, we'll be able to do it now. Hopefully. If I get all of these. That one's going to be coming this side. Hurry up, it's turning back. It turns back too fast. It's supposed to be a massive Star Destroyer. They can't turn that fast. Okay. Here we go. I feel it. It's going to be this one. Come on, turn. Turn faster. Mm. I might just... I, I think I stopped too early. What I need to do is just keep going. Even when the TIE Fighters start to appear. I can see him in the background there. Come on. Turn. Oh! We're so close though. Up. That's it. Come on, we're doing it. This is it. TIE Fighters, you're not going to stop me. Here we go. There, it's gone green. Alright, we better get out of there. We're going to die. Um, I, I don't know if that... It, the, it just changed from red to green. So we have done, done something right. Finally. Um, Hopefully... It is turning back still. God damn it, Star Destroyer. Oh. I'm missing all of these now. Damn it. Oh, hide, hide, hide. Okay. This is tougher than it seems. It's... It's quite annoying, but I'm liking it, I think. I think I'm liking it anyway. I can't quite tell. Oh, die. Damn it, I'm out of, out of juice. That is turning back too quickly, though, for my liking. Give me a little bit of a cooldown period, please. Quickly. Yeah, look, I have to do this all over again. What the hell? Oh. It's looked much more fun in the trailer. <laughs> I made up my mind, I'm not enjoying it. It's just, I've done it far too often now. Go green again. There's, like, there's no time to do it. Look, look at the TIE Fighters in the background. Come on. Come on. Go. Come towards me. You're not doing it. Why are you not coming to... Oh, right, I'm going to die. Oh, God damn it! If I have to do it all over... Well, I'm going to have to do it all over again, aren't I? Oh. Relax, General. I'm still here. Good. Good. We'll see you back at the ship. Master? 
proxy. Are you okay? Yes, I think so. But I think it may be best if you leave me here. What are you talking about? The shockwave. It burned out portions of my processor. My primary programming has been erased. I'm useless now. Proxy. You're not staying here. Come on. Oh my goodness. If that... I don't even know what to say about that. I just spent 50 minutes. 50 minutes trying to do that. 20 of it doing it the wrong way. I wanted, I wanted it to be so fun, the Star Destroy part, but that wasn't fun. I, I admit, I'm very, I'm very pleased that I did it. it. It did, it did make you proud when you actually did it. But oh my god, that was just some of the most annoying gameplay decisions I've ever seen. It, oh, I'm so pleased it's over. I'm, I'm so mixed about this. I'm kind of glad, and I hated it as well. <laughs> but anyway, back to the game. Um, we we did that mission, woohoo, Proxy's back, I thought he would be, and now that his main programming function has been burnt out, does that mean he's not going to try and kill us all the time? Because if so, I think he'd be a nice pal then, you know, without all the ambushing and stuff. So yay, Proxy's back, and we brought down the Star Destroyer. Um, didn't get enough force points, got quite a few of the holocrons though, 12 out of 15. Um, enemies defeated. Oh, I thought the Star Destroyer would be on there. Oh, no, it's not. Damn. Um, oh, proxy one. Uh, rewards, loads of crap, but oh, I'm so pleased that's over. So, until next time for, I think, what is the final mission? Was it the final mission? Yes, because this was the penultimate. So, for the next episode with the final mission, until next time, thank you for watching, and goodbye.